Jace, I've got something here that I think you're going to love. Oh. Have a look at that. Industrial strength webbing <laughs> with some kind of weird, sadistic carabiner. You know me so well. Oh, I do know you very oh, well. Oh, it ratches! That industrial strength webbing allows you to combine tightrope walking with trampolining. You want I, to have a go? I like the way you're talking. I would love to have a go. Shall we whoosh off? Let's whoosh and roll. Let's do it. Say hello to the cool and unique craze of slacklining. This physically demanding and technically challenging activity exploits the strength and flexibility of nylon webbing to allow tightrope trickery, aerial acrobatics and death-defying stunts. But getting started is altogether more down-to-earth. In fact, lots of stumbling and falling down-to-earth. <laughs> Maverick, a company based in Dorset, have taken all the separate bits of kit needed to slackline and put them all together in one pack. But buying it is one thing, mastering it is another. <laughs> now, the thing is, as Rachel and I are demonstrating, it's not particularly easy, but like any activity, the more you practice, the better you get until you're doing big springs and jumps and bounces and tricks in the air, which Rachel is about to do, weirdly enough. Try as I might, I continue to display the poise of a one-legged tripod. But Action Sports Bradbury... I don't feel too stupid. ..was slowly learning to tame the 50mm-wide tightrope. <laughs> I'm impressed. Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> it's got that essential ingredient that all urban sports have, you know, that you've just got to do it right. OK, I'm going, I'm going. You've got to just get that trick. And to show you what a little bit of practice can lead to, here's some more of that funky footage of the pros at work. How cool is that? 